What is up, guys? I got to go to MegaCon Orlando, and the name is not a lie whatsoever. The convention was huge, one of the biggest ones I've ever been to. It might even be bigger than New York Comic Con, which is kind of crazy to say. I went Friday and Saturday, and this is the first time that I've ever done a con multiple days. Usually I just go Saturday, but this time I got a press pass, so I was lucky enough to be able to go all weekend. With a huge con comes a lot of chaos, especially waiting in the celebrity lines. I heard some people say that they waited upwards of eight hours for Hayden Christensen, but luckily he wasn't on my list. Thankfully, I got to meet everyone that I wanted to. I only wanted four people, so that's good enough for me. The first person that I met was Sonequa Martin-Green from The Walking Dead. She signed on the right side of the poster and wrote her character name. That's kind of the standard for the poster anyways. She was nice and $80 in autograph, which I think is fair. She's also on the Star Trek show, but I don't watch that. I did get a video of me meeting her as well. Hi, how are you? I'm great, how you doing? I'm all good. Your death is one of the best parts of the show. Ooh, I love that. thank you. Yeah, not many actors get the walker treatment. That's true. Mm -hmm. And especially not that way. Exactly, where yeah. You do you know, doing it on purpose to uh -huh. save. Yeah, you know? you're, you're one of one, yeah. yeah. How many people get to take down Negan? It was a good plan, yeah, Sasha. It was. it was, almost worked, thank it you so much. Worked. Have it a good day. You too. Okay, so the next person that I met, I hate to say I was really disappointed by, and that's Henry Winkler. He's a Hollywood legend and known for being one of the nicest celebrities. I don't know if he was just having a rough day or he couldn't hear me, but I wasn't that impressed with him. Even though he's probably best known as Fonzie, I wanted him to sign my screen poster. He also gave me a little character name, Principal Himbry. I don't know what it was. I had kind of a weird experience. He was really nice to everyone while they were waiting in line. He went up and down the row many times and shook everyone's hand. But when I got up there, I tried to have a little conversation. I didn't need to know his life story or anything, but maybe he couldn't hear me. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt, but he just kind of ignored the question I asked him and just said, what do you want? His prices were a little weird. It fluctuated a lot. If you wanted him to sign one of his books, it was only 40, but I guess whatever I wanted, I think being that it was a poster, it was a deluxe item, so it cost $80. Um, overall, I'm a little disappointed with meeting him, but I guess I'm just gonna say he didn't hear me. The next person that I met was easily the biggest reason that I wanted to go to this con and one of the biggest celebrities I ever met, James McAvoy. You probably know him best as Professor X um, or Bill Denborough in It Chapter 2, but I wanted him to sign my VHS of a little movie called The Pool. He was only $100 in autograph and I almost regret not getting two things signed by him because $100 for a big A-lister like that is not bad at all. I was really torn if I wanted to get him to sign this or a photo from It Chapter 2, but it Chapter 2 really disappointed me. I don't know what it was. It was an overly long movie and it didn't need to be. So I decided why not go with the classic The Pool. I also got a video of me meeting him and he seemed really impressed that I managed to find a VHS of this movie. Hello, that's an underrated one right there. Yeah, you don't find those that often. And it's on video. That's crazy. Yeah, isn't that? It's an old one. There you are right there. Looking good, looking young. Thank you very much. Last but certainly not least is someone that I already met before, but I want to get her on something else. And that's Nev Campbell from the movie Reefer Madness. 99% of the people meeting her wanted something from Scream signed or occasional wild things and the craft. But I was the only one that wanted Reefer Madness. If you haven't seen this movie, I never say this, okay? If you have not seen Reefer Madness, you have to watch. It's one of the greatest movies of all time, seriously. I never say, I never give movie recommendations in my con videos, but I love this movie so much. She signed in this cool orange paint pen. She wrote Cameron, much love, signed Nev Campbell, and then wrote her character name, Mrs. Poppy. A lot of other people from this movie do conventions. I know Steven Weber and John Kasser, Kaiser do conventions as well. So it'll be cool to get more, uh, them on there too. Kristen Bell is the main character and chances are she's probably not gonna do one. She was $60 in autograph, but something I have to point out, I met her a few years ago at this convention called Monster Mania and she was also 60, and so she's one of the few celebrities that hasn't increased their autograph prices in the past few years. Here's a video of me meeting her as well. Hi, you are the best final girl of all time, but I know you better as the best five and dime owner of all nice. time, so. Very cool, I love that. How's it like being in a musical? That's gotta be fun. fun. It's gotta be fun. I love being in a musical. And you I got to work with- musical theater. Oh, really? My first job was Phantom of the Opera. Who'd you play? I was 15. I was one of the six ballet chorus, and I understudied Meg. That's the awesome. original Canadian cast. That's so Logan's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there we go. And your brother's in it too, right? My brother's the lead in this. There we go, yeah. A full yeah. family project. Cameron. Yeah, I had a blast on this. 
My brother is actually producing it as a play again in, in LA. It's going to open in November. I really? Think, oh my god, that's awesome. Yeah. I got to see that. Yeah. I love that you have this, it's great. I love it so much. <laughs> Thank you so much, have a good day. Thank you. As you can tell, she's so nice. She really takes her time with people. That's why the line took as long as it did. I think I was in there for four or five hours, but it was absolutely worth it because she's such a gem of a human being and easily the coolest person that I met at this convention. <laughs> Alrighty guys, those are all the autographs that I got at this convention. Megacon, this is my first time going, but I had an absolute blast. I had to travel across the United States to get here, but it was worth it. And I hope to return next year. I won't keep you guys for any longer. And thank you so much for watching another video. Bye.